Hi, I'm Release Fire here, so I'm going to talk you through my LEGO Star Wars The Skywalker Saga, the Hunt for Django walkthrough guide to cover off all of the challenges, the mini kits, and how to do the rolls to get away from the missiles when they're coming to you on lock. As ever, hopefully the video helps you out. If it does, drop me a like below. But to start with, you need to take out these devices. They look like beacons. You take out five of them and you'll pick up one of the mini kits and you can find them relatively early on. You also need to be able to navigate through this large tunnel without hitting any of the sides, without crashing. So if you can make it through this tunnel without doing that, you'll pick up the first of the challenges. Inside the tunnel, there's also a mini kit to be able to pick up and there's loads of blocks to be able to destroy for you to get the true Jedi to get the three Kuiper bricks so that covers off quite a lot just getting through this it gets a little bit tight towards the end of the asteroids but if you keep steady you should be able to make it through and then if you turn to your right you should see another one of these devices and then over on the other side there is another one to take you up to three you can then keep on going to find another one to take you up to four and then you want to carry on back towards where you started to be able to pick up this mini kit which is just floating in space and then next to it is another one of those devices with that done you can then get on after Django and if you look to the north of where he's hiding inside an asteroid you can see another device for you to blow up which will give you the fourth of the mini kits and then if you look underneath the asteroid where Django is hiding you'll see another mini kit just floating in midair it will trigger the cutscene with Django but as soon as that's done you should be able to to carry on flying to be able to pick that up and then you can start taking Django down and with all of the mini kits done it's just the last two challenges and the first of the challenges is to make it through this fight without getting hit by one of the seismic charges which you saw on the screen there the second thing you need to do is roll out of the way of missile lock now it's a really tricky one to do and essentially anytime you see incoming missile what you want to do is kind of wait a little bit and then just start rolling like crazy where well, you can see one coming towards me there it was really fiddly and it took me a long time to get this but essentially I just didn't do any damage on Django until I'd made it through that so I just kept on waiting and rolling whenever an incoming missile was coming towards me and eventually it gave me that challenge and then you can get on after Django make sure you don't chase him too much when he hides in the tunnel because he will detonate a seismic charge in there and if you get hit by that, that's your whole run ruined for the challenge to make it through without getting hit by a seismic charge. But if you can do all of that and make it through Lego Star Wars, the Skywalker Sagas, the hunt for Django, then you'll pick up all of the challenges, the mini kits, and you'll complete the rolls challenge. And that's everything you need to know. Like I said earlier, if the video helps you out, drop me a like below. You can subscribe to the channel if you haven't already with the link on the left hand side. It's always appreciated. And check out the rest of my guide videos for Lego Star Wars, the Skywalker Saga with the links on the right hand side. Leave any comments and I'll catch you next time.